Um, well, you have a, a lot more time to prepare, uh, a lot more film. On the court today, we probably did, I don't know, maybe an hour and 10, 15 minutes like, on the court. Uh, that doesn't even include the 15 minutes of stretching. Uh, most of it was in our film. So it wasn't a, a lot of uh, physical uh, work, it was more mental. I think that's uh, probably the biggest difference of the time you have to focus on one opponent. Does the film session just really go over what they do and try to bring it into your players? Things that they do well, assess they run, so they're familiar when they see it. Yeah, I mean, you have there's so many layers of the film session just on, on what we do, what they do, uh, what uh, their players do, and their personnel, uh, how can we uh, improve what we do and, and, and look at things that we didn't do well and see if we can fix those things going into the series. Uh, so there's a lot there's a lot of time. Our video guys have done a good job of putting all the film together over the last uh, few days going into the playoffs. We had to obviously prepare for a few different teams who we ended up playing. I think it, 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 today was, it was a lot of a lot of film, a lot of mental mental uh, preparation. We always talk about with Memphis as being a physical defensive game. Does it have to be that way or can you guys run the floor and do things where it's not such a well, half I, I, I think I mean you want it to be a basketball game. Uh, that's why we love this sport so much. You don't want you don't want it to be a football game. Nobody wants to watch that. Uh, and officials will do a good job uh, with that. It's a basketball game, and we want it, we want to be physical. Also, we want to play uh, within the rules and, and, and execute uh, our game plan. I'm sure they, they're the same way. They're they're big. I mean, they're, they're, that's the strength of their team. They're big. They got guys that are very skilled in that four and five spot. They have a really solid point guard that, that's playing the center, uh, basically like an all-star this year. What is the addition of Mike Miller? That's a, you know, putting a sharp shooter around him. He gives them uh, ability to stretch the floor. A guy that makes you know 46 percent of his threes. Uh, he's, he's a catch and shoot three, and he's a, a cerebral player. He knows where to be and where to spot up and where to uh, be in their offense. They have good. They got a, a center that is a great passer. You know, the point guard is a great passer. So, anytime you have shooting on the floor, it helps. Uh, just like us, when we get shooting on the floor, it helps us. But Mike uh, Miller is one of the best shooters in the league. Does it help that you guys have seen this team so many times so that Mike Miller is a, a wild card? Like, you're familiar that he can come off and have a big game? Yeah, I mean, we know what he does. You know, we have to always stay uh, close to his touch. And, and, and when, we're, when we're locked in on a player, We've done a good job, and obviously, it's not just him, they're their entire team, they're a skilled basketball team, uh, they're an offensive rebounding team, which are areas that we have to uh, do a good job of really paying close attention to. In the playoffs, it seems like teams do more to load up on Russell and Kevin. Does is, is that kind of make Serge's ability to work in the mid range and space the field that much more? Well, I think um, our ability to play um, off of one another is really important over the last few years and our ability to pass the ball uh, has improved also in the last few years. So I think that, that has helped us. Um, we've won a lot of games over the years, but we played a little bit different throughout the last few years by uh, moving the ball and, and everybody seems to get opportunities to touch. Uh, and you know, when teams do load up, you know, we have opportunities for open threes. We've done a great job with our three-point shooting you know, take away the first month of the season. Well, I, I think Serge has made a big jump on, on all areas of the game. Uh, not just what he's, uh, I think the easy thing to look at is what he's improved offensively, but he's also proved things defensively. His pick and roll coverage is much better. His post defense is much better, but his offense, his mid-range game is really, really good. I mean, it's been good for a while now, but he's taken, he's taken his shot out to the three-point uh, line. He doesn't take a lot of them, but he can do that. His, his, he has, um, he has a, a good chemistry with Kevin and Russell with pick and roll play. He, he finds a good job, or he does a good job of getting separation off of those coverages. And those are the areas that we worked on. Uh, throughout the year with him and all of our guys, but he's really done a good job of coming back this year, being much better all around.